Well, we've uh, liked what we've seen so far. We've had pretty good effort um, from our kids. You know, it's been been hot and humid, but uh, you know they've done a nice job adjusting to that. And you know, good effort, good attitude so far. And you know, as a group, that's really what you're looking for those first two weeks is, you know, how is their effort and, and what is their attitude like, and they've done a really nice job so far. You know, when you take a look at this senior class, it's a group that when they were sophomores, they started to progress sectional championship game against Belmont, and they made a lot of strides during the second half of their sophomore season, another jump last year. I mean, this is a season you guys have been looking forward to here at Leo for a while. Yeah, I mean, we have been looking forward to it, um, you know, for all the reasons you just mentioned. Um, we know that um, you know we're going to have to still get after it and play. You know we don't take anything for granted. Um, you know this is a new season, and um, if we don't execute and we don't practice, then it's going to be a long season for us. So we know we still have to work and really get after it if we're going to be successful and if it's um, going to be the kind of season that we're hoping for. As far as you guys go, uh, what do you take away from last season that you guys can apply here towards 2010? Well, you know the experience thing. Um, you know, like you said, we've had sophomores have been playing for for a while, so they've had some experience. Um, you know, we've hit camp with, with the same offense and same defense that we've had since, you know, really I, I've gotten here. Um, so that experience helps, and, and, and hopefully we can build on that and get better with that experience. Um, you know, another thing that that we're kind of just we're, we're looking at is you know we got new some new players at some positions. Um, so, you know, they're trying to adjust to, to the, those new spots. So they're working on that and doing a nice job. Talk about your running back combo because uh, with Kyle and Connor back there, that's one of the best uh, comeback one-two punches <laughs> here in the area. Yeah, well, they're, they're pretty talented players. Um, you know, they both have a lot of speed. Um, they both run the ball hard. So, you know, we are, we're looking forward to them and seeing what they can do. You know, they have a pretty experienced offensive line in front of them. Uh, we've got three seniors back. Um, and Bill Shankle, Jordan Bear, and uh, Wes Reese, um, and a couple new players um, filling holes up front. But you know, with that experience line and, and those two players, you know, we think they can do some good things for us. Do you feel a, a certain sense of hunger uh, with this senior class, knowing that they have made steps each year, but now they know, hey, this is their last chance to do it? Yeah, yeah. I know. I think we have a, a definite sense of urgency. You know, it being the last, you know, their last chance to do some things. You know, at first it was a, an ACAC championship, which they accomplished last year. And now we're looking and hoping for maybe a sectional championship and competing in, in a tough sectional. Um, you know, they, they know that this is their last chance to do that. Um, so I think there's, there is a, a sense of hunger there and a sense of urgency that they want to get that done. Um, and they know that they, they have to really get after it to make that happen because it is a very tough and competitive sectional. Uh, Norwell week one, uh, what's going to be the key against the Knights? Was a, was a close ball game down at their place last year. Now you get them here at Lions Field. Yeah, well, uh, you know, one thing with, uh, with the Norwell team is they always come out and they play very physical. Um, we're going to have to play physical. We have to take care of the football. Um, you know, one thing that hurt us last year is we had, uh, you know, several fumbles, interceptions. So, you know, those game one type things that, um, you know, sometimes you, you don't do right. We've got to take care of and do a better job. Um, so if we can play physical, take care of the football, you know, hopefully success will follow after that. But tell me where you guys are at with your quarterback position. Well, we have junior Ryan Leiter stepping in. He's done a nice job in camp. Um, he's getting better daily. Um, so we're excited to have him um, lead, this, lead this offense. When it comes to Connor, what makes him a, a special player? Obviously, just eight yards away from the all-time rushing record at Leo, heading into a senior season where he should have another big year. Yeah, well, you know, Connor has uh, really, really good speed. You know, he's really fast. He, um, he can, he can run hard too. He can put his head down and, and gain those extra yards. So, um, you know, we like what he does. Um, you know, we want to see a little, a little bit of leadership out of him his senior year. Um, but you know, overall, you know, the, the speed has has been real nice for us. Um, with both Kyle and Connor. All right.